No, please let me out. Hey guys, it's Dr. Robotnik64, and today I'm playing uh, the original SCP-087 game. So, um, yeah, so this is the original game, basically. So, um, yeah, I decided to uh, try the original game out just to see what it was like. Wonder does it actually still mark the uh things here? And by things I mean um order. Oh, one. Number one. Alright. And this me it's dark here. I don't think there's any way to configure the like brightness setting. Number two. Gotta go down the flight of stairs. That's another thing, actually. The stairs are different. It's just like complete, completely just stairs. You're going down into the depth of this place of some kind. Number four, well, are we doing good right now? Gotta keep going down. Yeah, the screen's like so dark I can actually see myself. In the, uh... The, um... Computer. The computer screen. Number six. Uh, apparently there's not a lot of things that, uh, and I said apparently strange. Uh, apparently there's not a lot of things that really, uh, happen in this version of SCP. Um, 087, I should say. Um, apparently you can get down to, like, hundreds of flights, and you would, well, you'd be, you're able to get down to, like, a hundred flights, and probably even more, because apparently there's no end to it, and... Not only that, but, um, yeah, well, SCP-087-B, I was only able to get to floor 21. Apparently, you can get up to, like, floor 300, apparently, in here. So there's not really a lot of events that occur here. Get out of here, rail. No wonder some people call this Stair Simulator 2012. Just walking down a flight of stairs. Hear something. Hear some sort of like breathing. Number 11. Yeah. You can actually jump. Pretty darn high, too. Well. Number 12. Alright then. Doing good so far. There's like not a lot of things that's happening. And that breathing sounds actually not really freaking me out to be honest. It's getting louder. So we must be getting closer to the guy who's breathing like that. Number 14. Oh. Surprised this guy doesn't tire himself out by going down all these stairs. Fifteen. Uh oh. Just keep walking down. Don't look behind you. Yeah, that's that's basically the main premise of these like horror games. Don't look behind you or else you'll die. So just keep going. Yeah, there's definitely something following me, so we just just keep going. Stop. Ah! <laughs> okay, uh, Shadow just popped out. Okay, well. That sort of scared me. Okay, well that was actually sort of funny, the way I screamed like that. My goodness. I don't know, I find that I... I find that I scream sort of 
strange, and I also see him talk sort of strange sometimes. All right then. Just find that so funny. Number twenty-one. I think this guy. I think. Yeah, it's either this guy who's breathing or it's you know who. Keep going down. Okay then. Oh, another shadow. All right then. See, because now that I've seen it, it's not really going to freak me out. It's pretty much just going to annoy me. So, I see. I see what you're doing, SCP-087. I see what you're doing. Don't think. Don't think it's going to scare me a third time. Like continuously going down, and yet this guy is still going down these stairs. He is not tired yet. All right then, we're doing we're doing good so far. Seen two shadows. We didn't see SCP-087 himself though. This is Stair Simulator 2012. Okay. 28. By the way, I'm also thinking of, uh, well, probably doing more horror games. Uh oh. No, 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 no. Keep, run keep, keep walking down. There's nothing to be afraid of. Alright? SCP-087, punch him in the face. How about that? I'm actually surprised. This isn't really as scary as SCP-087-B, probably because there's more things that can happen in SCP-087-B than the original SCP-087. Because, like, anything can happen. You can just randomly pop out of nowhere. I think I hear somebody else's footsteps. Where are we at, anyway? Thirty-five. Holy jeez. Okay, then. Not too bad so far. It's actually getting kind of boring, to be honest. Because it's just like walking down a flight... As I was saying, just walking down a flight of stairs, because I thought I heard something there for a second. So it's actually sort of boring, to be honest. I'm just going to keep continuing, though, so... Still going. Okay, that breathing sound is sort of story. Sort of sort I'm, I'm just going to refrain from talking right now. I was going to say that the breathing sound that's starting to freak me out, actually. No, it's him! Oh, you wanna, you wanna. Well, that was just unfair. That was just on. That was an unfair fight. I want a rematch. Well, my goodness. But um, well, there you go. That was SCP-087. So apparently, the way he kills you is that. He has apparently these long hands, I guess, and he just he just like touches you and you like explode or something. 
I don't know, but then, well, don't explode, but you know what I mean. Touch you, you die, so. Alright then, so that's basically SCP-087, but I'm not going to go, I'm not going to try this again right now anyway, because I don't want to go for another, like, 40 or 50 flights of stairs just to see him again, so. Um, because it's going to take a bit too long, so, yeah. But, uh, apparently that's just basically what he does. Alright then. But, um, yeah, so that's basically SCP-087, uh, the original one, that is. Uh, hold on. Oh, trying to burp there, but anyway, uh, yeah, if you want to download this game for yourself, the link is in the description, so, yeah, that was, that's basically the original SCP-087 for you, so, yeah. Well, anyway, this was a gameplay video for SCP-087, this is Dr. Robotnik64, thank you for watching, and, um, actually, just like SCP-087-B, when once SCP-087 actually kills you, it exits, it exits out of the game. So, yeah, sort of like uh, the B version. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next gameplay video. Later.